friends. We are here today with a new game. Uh, if you know anything about me, you know that I am relatively new to gaming. And so I am late to the party for a lot of these games. I'm sorry, I'm fashionably late to a lot of these games. So I've been hearing about Townscaper and it seems very interesting to me. So let's see what happens. In my head, this is kind of like, like a bubble wrap kind of a game, if you know what I mean. There's not really any tasks that you're supposed to do. It's just to, to build and have fun. Like there's, I guess I would say there's no point, but that is the point, right? Okay, and so, see this appeals to me. <laughs> you can, let's just see here. Let's, let's change the color. So you can keep building. Oh, yup, yup. How do I change the... Maybe I don't. Let's see if I can change how I can see it, but I don't know that I can. Let's change the color again. I mean, okay. Oh, and it like put a patio on top. Okay. So this whole thing is you like click to see what shapes you can build, right? I This just so intrigues me. And you can just keep going up and up and up. And I love that you can change the colors. So you know I'm excited if I sing it. <laughs> so you can build like whole communities apparently? Okay, I like this. Is, is it building me a beach? And then as you put things, you can see like it puts, it adds little decorations to it, which is super cute. Let's see how big we can make this puppy. Like how, and it keeps changing the shape, which I love. Look at that. Okay, I can see, I can see why people enjoy this game. Actually, speaking of games I haven't played yet, there are a gazillion of them. So I think I'm actually going to start like a new series called, you know, like Fashionably Late and um, try out, seriously, look at that, try out some of the games I have yet to play. Because again, there are loads. Okay, you can like literally just go right over the water. What? Okay. That looks a little bit like a duck face though. Let's Let's. <laughs> okay, let's let's see what we got here. Can we um? What, what's the grid? Uh, oh. Okay, this is interesting. So this tells you what shape it's gonna be on the grid. That's pretty cool, actually. I I enjoy that. <laughs> what does that mean? Oh, I don't like that. Um. Yeah. Nope. Nope. Let's go back to what it was. And uh, we don't want we don't want that. We don't want the grid. No, we do not. Okay, I can do that. I'm kind of just figuring out. Oh, can we like go into town? <gasps> what? Oh my gosh. Okay. Right mouse click that changes things. Oh my gosh! Look at how cute that. There are like little benches on the patio. We do have little private beaches. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> little birds. <laughs> oh, little birds have moved in. That's that's cute. You know what? I think we're going to just leave this open. Okay? We're going to leave that part open. Screenshot. Heck yeah, we are. Look at all the birds on top of the building. That is so gosh darn cute. Okay, let's let's do like a little a whole little neighborhood over here. How about Oh, that's not what I meant to do. But you know what? That works. Do you hear the little plunking noise it makes? Okay, that's not what I meant. Oh! 
let's change the color. Let's just change the color. My question is, how do I see over here? I just keep plunking away. I maybe should have started from the back and come forward. Is that what I'm getting right now? Um, and you notice then too, there's different levels. Depending on how many clicks and you get different little patio areas. Which is very cute. Uh, oh, undo. Yeah, we don't want that. We don't want that. I just... Okay, the little plunk noise does get me. <laughs> do enjoy that. <laughs> okay. Let's... Do we have... What what color are we on now? We've got purple. Let's do a little... Pur See, I don't mind that little guy. Let's do a couple little houses. Now, this is fun. This is fun. And there's little stairwells down to their little private beaches. Okay, that's cute. That is very cute. It was like a little mailbox for when the the ship comes through with your mail. That is precious. You heard me, precious. There's a bigger house. He's blocking the view for the other guys. Ugh, rude. You know what though? Look what we're gonna do. We're gonna just make this one bigger. So big, you're not even gonna know. Hmm. <laughs> oh, shoot! I figured out how to spin it. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay. Just look at the details. Oh my goodness. I like. Oh my gosh. That is cute. So then you just keep you just keep on keeping on, eh? Okay, so our little purple village. Let's work on this a little does that remind anyone else of like a sewing machine? I think that is amazing. Okay, let's let's get a new color. Let's what do you think? Should we do blue? A little how about the sea foam? Um and let's build up this part and do should we do it like in a circle? Maybe. I think maybe circle. Well, whatever circle they let us do. With with some water in the middle. Right? Oh, I kind of like that. Kind of weird. I kind of like that. Um, let's put a bigger one over here. Oops, that's not what I meant to do, but now it is. We're just gonna keep. Oh, whoop! Rotate. How did I rotate? How... Oh, there, there she is. Okay, and let's undo that last one. <laughs> I just think that's so cute. Um, you know what? Let's put a spire right there. Oh, that's not even a spire. Oh. Um, I think we need a new color, though. Yeah. If we do orange, is it still going to have an orange roof? I hope not. Let's, um... Let's continue around here. Okay, let's spin. Okay, yeah, once you figure out, like, the mechanics of it all... Oh, I like that. I like that. It has a little private area down there. Should we give him a private beach? Obviously. But do they, they don't have steps to their beach? Oh, because the door is over here. I, I, I'm with you. I'll give you a bigger beach. Oh, and it adds doors? And like little tunnels. Okay, you guys. I am loving this. Again, it's like... I don't know, like it does remind me of the, of, of the bubble wrap, okay? It's just so satisfying, but also a little bit Tetris. A little bit Tetris in there as well. Oh man, I feel like you could just make this huge and beautiful, and I do like that orange. Um, what color are we lacking? Let's do we need some more? Oh, did our greens get swallowed up? Let's do this one. Um, Let's, let's, 
separate but together. How about separate and together? We'll get the greens going. First, we're just going to do some little guys, just some little ones, right? Just some little guys. And then we will add on. He'll have it. Oh, mm -hmm. noise. <laughs> I feel like over here there needs to be. Oh, okay, let's just appreciate the cute little stuff they have. Boots on the step. Are you kidding me? Come on now. Okay, that's also something cool. Like, <laughs> just to see all of the little hidden things. Like, there's another little mail drop. I approve a hundred percent. Give you a spire. Actually, oh, it keeps going. Um, let's undo. <laughs> I don't want it that tall. And actually, that's the, the roof I wanted to go with. But let's make this one taller. Maybe this is some kind of. <gasps> oh yeah, yeah. I, for I forgot we could do that. like that it's kind of wonky shapes. Let's, let's do a new color here. What don't we have? Mm, How cute that is. It's just so cute. Patio areas, those are so cute. Um, oh, shoot. What did that do? Oh, we got a whole. Oh, look at we got a whole new shape, people. We got a whole new shape. Oh, okay. Screenshot, yes, please. <laughs> I'm like really just super impressed with myself right now. My goodness. Okay, this little, I feel like this little part right here is getting kind of lost. This part. Maybe it needs a little, a little something, something. You know, just a little guy. Yeah. The little bench in the front. Y'all are seeing this, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. It even makes the bubble pop sound noticed it does a little poppy pops I I appreciate that I don't know what's this one like chartreuse okay, let's let's chartreuse it up over here oops did I go over top and it deleted it okay that's good to know okay okay let's yep going down to their little beach cute I lost myself. <laughs> Just for a second. I am found. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, 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 it connected it. Because they're different colors, though, they stay separate. Okay. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, I like that one. Um, I just lost what I was doing because I was so excited about that. Should we make this guy bigger? Or just give him more space. Should he go over the water? Obviously. Oh, and then he has a little patio up top. Is that like a little separate house now? How do you get up there, huh? How are you getting up there? Oh, no, it's part of the main house. It just has a door to the outside. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. <laughs> you see all these birds over here? They're just chilling. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm just gonna keep playing. <laughs> I I wanna see okay, let's let's uh, let's get some red. I wanna see what other shapes the houses take on if they're big. Let's let's do something challenging, shall we? Let's get something going. Um Okay, now it's put 
adding another level. Oh, okay, that's interesting. That's an interesting shape. I... Yeah, it's just, I mean, it's very cool to see what's gonna happen next, right? Like, that's a cute little building. Me likey. Uh, let's do another color over here. Let's do some, uh... Did we already do this yellow? Oh, look at how cute that is. Let's check, let's check the grid. Cause it was, okay, there was like three little ones together. It's cute, y'all. Let's see what just happens. Oh, what if I want to undo? Whoops, undo. This is my little lighthouse, obviously. It just, I mean, okay, there's only so many things you can do with that shape, I guess. <laughs> but I do, I do enjoy that. So let's build around it, but not touch it. Because I do want to keep that giant spire right there. Uh, oh, you know what? I'm going to add another color to keep the little houses separate, but together, if you know what I mean. Uh, let's do some blue. <laughs> yes, I am impressed with myself, in case you didn't notice. Way. See, that's super cute. Let's let's get in there and see. Yep, we've got a little chair. We've got little flower pots. Oh my goodness. I I hate that I've missed this my whole life. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is something that really could have kept me going during COVID. Because I think this game came out in like 2020. I I see the appeal. I <laughs> I 100% see the appeal. Let's do some more purple. Let's connect. Let's just connect here. And let's let's get some purple going. First, we will do a little house. Um, I'm curious though. Okay, yeah, it like turns weird, doesn't it? Did that swallow that little green one? It certainly did. Um, maybe little greeny needs to go higher. Oh, it put the purple on top. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm not even mad at that. Let's see. Let's see what it did though. Ooh, little bug there. All as well. Okay. So what are we looking for? The little purple. Okay. I actually, I actually like that. It adds the the second color. That's fun. That's so fun. Okay, we're headed back across the water. There's a little guy. Um, make him a little. Ooh, that's a neat shape. Okay, we need another color. Let's do um, sea foam. Let's connect this neighborhood. So if you have a big enough square, like town square in the middle, I'm curious if it then gives you more stuff, you know? So let's like over here, we gave it some more. Hmm. Let's let's just see what happens. Plop 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 plop. I like when it's on the stilts. I didn't mean for it to be on stilts, but there we are. Oh, and there's still a, oops. Um. Yay. I, I feel like I can maybe just do this forever. Um. 
I mean, I would never. Never. I mean, maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Look how cute that is. Oh my goodness. The different shapes are. Oh my. Oh. Do you see this? Now it's like connected with a little. A little laundry. Okay, this game is top notch. Um. <laughs> this is amazing. Screenshot. Yes, please. My little town. Boop, boop. Hey, um. So, like, how do I save it? What does that mean? Export OBJ. Um. I have no idea. Uh. Let's see what it means. Export. Does that mean my little town? Let's try it. We're just gonna be super interesting and just do like town one and save it. Um, set a screenshot folder. Yes, please. Uh, a town of giver. Photos. Oh, it. Oh, okay, I see. We're supposed to already know what it is that I don't. Um, so I'll be here trying to figure it out. <laughs> Do we need just like a super big house somewhere that's like in your face? How about if we buy the red one here? So what color should we make it? How about, what have we not used? Have we done like the seafoam we have? Let's do another... Let's do some more yellow. And I feel we're just going to make it big and in charge. Large and in charge because that's what it does. Let's, let's see what's happening on this side. Oh, that's very cool. I like when it jumps like that and, and puts another level. Oh, I think we got it. I think we got it. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. One more? Do we need the spire? I, I mean, maybe. Yeah, I think maybe we did. So... Let's, let's zoom out. So this... This game is amazing. It really is. You know what? Okay, since I'm going to be uh, doing a new a new series. Let's get serious about it. Let's get scientific about it, okay? I'm gonna rate this puppy on like, would I recommend it or not, okay? So, all right y'all, let's talk about Townscaper. Okay, so I said I was gonna rate these. <laughs> so I went full scientific method, okay? We've got our slides and we're gonna go through and just rate it on different scales, on games I enjoy playing, also, not even just is it good, bad, but just facts. Is it cozy, farming, adventure, survival, that kind of thing. So so you'll know, and you'll know if you want to play this. So first off, is it a cozy game? It absolutely is a cozy game. Uh, it's a no-brainer. You can sit. You can just kind of experiment with the different buildings, with the grid to see what happens in the different shapes. I would call that cozy for sure. Farming. Nope, there is no farming involved. And I actually like that about this game as well because almost every other game I play does have some kind of a farming aspect. <laughs> so it's a it's a nice change for me. Um, is it an adventure game? I put kind of, because for me, seeing what the buildings are gonna pop up like was kind of fun and exciting. And I guess I, Adventure exciting. I, I use those two together. So for me, it was kind of an adventure game The adventure was seeing what you could build and what it was gonna look like Once you clicked all of the little squares, so I, I would say kind of it's kind of an adventure game Is it a survival game? Heck no, it's not and that's another reason. I really liked it <laughs> Sometimes I don't want to have to run away from things killing me. Is it story driven? No, no, it is not um, I mean, I guess you could have a story in your head of what's going on, but uh, the game in and of itself is not story driven. Is it family friendly? 100% family friendly. I could see a kid 
coming on here and making an amazing town. I, I feel like sometimes kids are better at that kind of thing than we are. Would I play this again? Absolutely I would. This is one of those things if I've had a rough day at work. Like this would be fun to do and just no brainer, you know? I, I, sometimes those no brainers are really nice. <laughs> My favorite part of this whole thing, that you don't have to think too hard. I mean, bottom line, sometimes you just want to do something that's mindless. And, and this is, <laughs> mindless sounds bad. But you don't have to overthink things, and when you're done, you have this beautiful town. I mean, it's a win-win for me. My least favorite part, I can't add my own design elements. So you saw the little, like, benches and, and potted plants and boots and things. It would be fun to be able to add other little things, especially to the big open square areas, to be able to put things in there but I know that's not what this game is about that is fine so drum roll please my overall rating 8 out of 10 I really enjoyed it um, I would definitely play it again now 10 out of 10 for me is like dinkum that's my only 10 out of 10 <laughs> so it'd be very difficult for something to reach that high but 8 out of 10 is is a pretty glowing review from this gal I really liked it and I hadn't heard about it till just recently Again, it's from 2020 have any of you played this game I'm just curious uh, and what did you think of it so there you go boozy's assessment uh, what other games would you like to see me play curious and I will see you all next time bye